in which we rewrote the entire ethics code. We spent over six months working on that, and we came up with something that everybody could agree to. And that's the type of um, person that I'll be on the assembly. Thank you. Okay, thank you, Trevor. And then we have Dave Miles. My name's Dave Miles. This is my 16th time running for office. <laughs> I've always brought up basic issues like public transit and other things that aren't addressed by other candidates. I've lived in Alaska 32 years. I've run a lot of my own businesses. Uh, this week, I have a flyer in the top class newspaper, the little free classified paper that the uh, Frontier High School puts out. Uh, in it, I describe that early voting has started today, actually. Anybody can go down to the, the borough and vote early. Um, the election is uh, Tuesday, October 2nd, and it goes until 8 p.m., so there's many opportunities to vote. These five questions that I posted to the uh, other candidates are if they are against the sales tax, and we've always voted it down in this city and borough of Fairbanks, if they are for public transportation, that's been my big issue, and I'm so glad we finally have evening bus service. Uh, to increase the homeowner exemption, Wolfgang Falk has been working on this issue and has a petition. Right now you get 20 grand or 20%, whichever is less, off your taxes, off your home. This would increase it to 100 grand off your home before it's taxed, a basic step to help people keep, stay in their own homes. We need state-funded land-grant school funding to further reduce local property taxes. And I've always spoken about splitting the property tax off buildings so people are free to improve and it would end idle land speculation, the great destroyer of civilizations that turns people away from productive work and just holding the land away from their neighbors. This next week, I, in the top class, I have uh, statements by all the candidates, and you can check that out. It comes out in a couple days, the next issue. Um, I asked the North Pole City Council candidates to make a statement. Only one responded, and that was Victoria Thompson. Her statement was, a city can only be as great when its citizens are informed, cooperating, and working together. So I appreciate Victoria Thompson responding to that. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you, Dave. Uh, you've answered probably most of our questions. <laughs> Your opening statement. <laughs> but uh, you start. You start the round.